Hello, hi everybody. <clears throat> um, so I'm recording because I have decided to go out and purchase hair affinity. I <clears throat> believe that I it is shipped on the eleventh and I got it today and today is the April 13, 2012, and I just got my package today. I just came home from school, and, um, okay, and after much consideration, I decided that hair affinity would be a good idea for me because, now, I don't have any hair growth problems, right? My hair grows. I know how much my hair grows. You know, I always like have always measured my hair it's been a habit of mine because I'm, I've always been obsessed with my hair so um this 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 is not my hair so you know this is not my hair and this is not an official video this is just like an introduction to why I bought hair affinity now um the reason why I bought hair affinity is because of several things because first of all okay all the people that are raving about it <laughs> second of all because I've never tried anything internal to deal with um, my hair growth, to better it, to thicken it, to soften it. Um, and also, um, <clears throat> ever since starting college again this semester, <clears throat> every semester I eat horribly. Not that I eat junk, I eat less. Um, I tend to lose weight during the school time and gain weight during the summer. Um, the only reason I would gain weight during the summer is if I don't exercise because I'm like an exercise freak. Once I start, you know, and I have a lot of time to keep going, I keep going and I don't let nobody tell me I'm overdoing it. But um, during school time, there's no time, you know. Well, there is time, but I'm the kind of person if I want to do something, I want to do it to the max. You know what I mean? I want to do it to the max, to the extreme so I can't work out like I want to, but I do work out um, at least three times a week. It's just light workout, you know. I'm more of a, um, you know, the insanity workouts. I love those types of workouts. But right now I'm just doing Zumba and stuff like that, light work. So I eat not as well and not as much during um, school semester. So I know that I'm lacking nutrients. I want to see. Any vitamins that I take will help me at this point because pretty much I am not getting them. Because let me tell you my, how my day will be. I'll snack on maybe a few, uh, a granola bar or maybe um, a couple, like half a cup of dry cereal. Because usually I don't drink milk or usually I'm in a run and I just grab a little baggie of cereal. So maybe that's for breakfast. Then um, I won't eat again until maybe two or three or maybe five. And I'll eat chips, um, at least two bags of chips. And then when I get home, depending on what day it is, I won't eat or <clears throat> um, I'll eat something or I'll eat. And whatever I eat will be light because I'll be going to sleep and I don't eat heavy before I go to sleep. So, I mean, even if I'm starving, I will not eat heavy before I go to sleep. I just can't. I don't want to. I don't like it. So it's just a habit I've formed for myself. So, um, so pretty much I need vitamins anyway because I'm not getting the maximum nutrition that I need. Also, another thing is that I am not drinking as much water as I should be. I'm, I used to drink only one bottle of water a day and I know I'm not supposed to drink just one. I'm supposed to drink like four or something. Um, I've increased it to two bottles a day, but I'm definitely going to increase it more, especially since it's getting hotter. I'm naturally going to be drinking more water. Um, also, I've noticed that my nails are suffering tremendously. Like, they're so soft. I used to be able to grow my nails, like, to the sky. And now they're so soft. They're always ripping. Every lab, like, every lab I have to do in, um, in my biology class, my nails are always breaking on something, grabbing something, picking something up, you know. It's just, I don't know. So, I need help with that. Um, hopefully that helps for that. Now... I know that my hair grows a half an inch a month. This I know. I know. Because I've been measuring, like I said, I've been measuring my hair since I was a little girl. Um, I've always measured my hair with a ruler. 
this is what I'm why I'm saying it's half an inch. I'm not estimating it actually is half an inch a month that my hair grows. If in the end of this month or the end of um next month, these sixty days, um my hair does not grow more in these sixty days, my hair does not grow more than an inch, I will not take hair from me anymore because that is not, you know, it's not exceeding the potential of my natural hair growth. So there won't be no point. Why am I paying fifty dollars for a two month supply of something that's not giving me any change? I mean, vitamins are good nonetheless. So we'll see how that goes. Um and then again, I relax my hair twice a year. <sighs> um this is I've always done that. I went natural last year and I was only natural for like seven months and I relaxed because of single strand knots could not stand them in my um my natural hair so I relaxed um but I've always stretched my hair for six to seven months um sometimes I stretch my hair to a year and it's because I don't usually keep my hair out anyway so I have no problem doing that also I will not be getting a trim with this hair affinity all I do is um go throughout my hair and cut the um the um the split ends I cut the split ends off so that's what I'll be doing I'll just be going through my hair and cutting the split ends off I took before pictures but I don't think they were bright enough I'm not gonna put that up yet but um I entered a contest to win hair affinity um curls with loves contest and I don't know I was gonna buy the hair affinity anyway I was just but it would be nice to have that extra bottle of that first prize, you know. But, whatever. Um, so... Also, I want to let you know, I'm not pregnant. I have not been pregnant. There's nothing. I'm in good health. I don't have any heart problems. Um, uh, anytime I've had anything that I feel like is in my chest or my heart or anything like that, I always go, I go to the doctor and he just says, growing pains. We get an x-ray, we get, you know, everything done for my back, my chest, everything. And he says there's nothing wrong, even though I feel the pain, but he says there's nothing wrong. So I agree with him. Um, so I've heard this one lady had, um, well, maybe a few ladies had a hypo, um, hyper, you know, the heart, hyper, Rhythmia or something like that had their heart beating faster than normal. Oh, increased heart rate, yes. So, um, I hope that doesn't happen to me. I don't know how I'm gonna take it. I knew that I was gonna take that I was gonna get it in the mail before the before the weekend, and I knew that it was gonna happen like that. So, I don't know if I want to take two in the morning to see since I'm gonna be home anyway, or if I should take one at morning, one at night, or two at night. I don't know. I don't want to take two at night. Because I don't want to sleep and not wake up. <laughs> Just saying. Because I've never taken anything internally for my hair and at this potency. This potent. So, um, I'm probably going to put in, I'm going to do another video with my hair. And after that, immediately I'm going to put in the weave because I cannot keep my hair out this long. Like me just having my hair like in the back out. It's not out, but it's, it's, it's in the bun. It freaks me out. Like, I cannot have my hair out like this. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to count my pills. I'm going to come come on to come on here with probably my other camera and a, um, I'm going to count the pills and let you guys know if I have 60 in there. Um, I'm just open the package so you guys can see. The package smells funny. <laughs> The toy looking. Toy in between the two. I can't sing. Don't even judge me. Don't even. Oh, also another thing I wanted to say. Okay, so this is their pamphlet. I'll show you guys that in the next video. But I have skin problems. You see, not skin problems, but I'm having like a lot of breakouts and a lot of. I always have dark marks because I do not leave my pimples alone. I don't. I feel like they don't belong on my face. They're gonna get it. They're gonna get it. Ooh. So these are the these are the bottles. Initially, I thought that you know 
the first month bottle would be different than the second month's bottles, but I don't think that is it because there's no like labeling. So I'll come back to you guys another time with um uh, with another video on updates. So today is April 13, 2012 and this is my hair affinity introduction video.